Right guys, so I'm in Z's Peri Peri. Um, we just ordered some food and I just put some vlogs in of how the food looked like. Unfortunately, I didn't vlog very much. It was really nice in here, really, really busy. The place is pretty packed. I mean, we're here on a Monday night and the place is really, really busy. We had to wait for a table. Um, staff is quite friendly. Um, they're all dressed in sort of purple sort of uniforms. You might see one past in a second. There's one going past us now. That guy is actually one of the gaffers here. So two gaffers. We're going to speak to them a bit as well. Um, food is all of the, came out pretty quick and um, pretty fresh as well. Uh, we ordered uh, one of the main things over here. So we ordered some peri peri chicken. And we also ordered some pizza. Pizza, I think, came out the winner. Um, peri peri is pretty good for Cambridge, but I think we're a bit spoiled in the Midlands. We've got things like you know peppers, and we've got pepes, and we've got Nando's, and we've got all of those similar brands over there, which are sort of competing. I think flavour-wise, they're a lot better, um, and you get more value for your money over there. But I think for Cambridge. You know, I think it's pretty reasonable compared to some of the food I've seen around here. Um, and it's all fresh and it's quite busy. Um, I mean, as I said, Monday night and it's really, really busy over here. So, you know, it reflects and I've seen the reviews of this place. It, people have reviewed it really good because of the, the standard of food. It is quite fresh and um, In terms of sauces, they're all in bog, bog standard sort of sauces which came out here. Um, we did have a little bit of a mishap with the order as well. Um, so we ordered some, um, part of the starters, we ordered uh, some potato skins and some uh, cheese sticks. Instead of the cheese sticks, we got the Zalfina poppers um, and they completely forgot about the cheese uh, you know, potato skins. Um, they have just uh, passed it to us now, uh, which we've had to pack in more today because we've finished our food by now. Um, but yeah, great vibe. I mean, if you look around now, it's a small place. The seating's not that great. Uh, however, um, it is busy and people are moving here um, yeah, with their families. So it is a family sort of place. Parking is a bit of an issue here because mostly it's residents only. However, if you come after 8 o'clock, I think you can park as well as the side streets over here. So, overall, guys, I'm going to rate it out of 5. I'm going to rate it 3 and a half based on uh, the flavours and um, you know, more than not being 100% right. But apart from that, you know, it is a great place. I would say, you know, for Cambridge, it is probably the place to come in terms of halal food and fresh. Uh, so, full marks on that. And, um, come along and have a, have a try, tell me what you think. Um, so, I mean, my family enjoyed it, but I think flavors were a little bit bland compared to some of the places that we go. But overall, um, yeah, three and a half out of five is what I would uh, give it. Um, tell me down, you know, comment down below and tell me what you think. Has anybody been over here? And what kind of food have you had? You know, have you had pizzas? Have you had uh, burgers? Have you had? Because uh, I haven't tried the burgers, um, so I tried the main two things, which were the chicken and the pizza. Pizza came out really fresh. Okay, I can see the place is extremely busy. Right? Yeah, that's you do a delivery as well. 
down below if you are in the area and you want halal food this is the place to go